sheets like the one here in Jamaica. I just hope this cabin trip brings us closer. I once was a man that liked a lot of women. Yeah. But I've been thinking about forever. Like yeah. lately, you know what I mean? With this girl, like, I bought Shorty a ring. What? To spice. Yes. To the queen. To the queen, yes. baby. Yes. 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 can't get away till tomorrow, but I came a day early with Carly so I could get all the sun in that I can. one of the hottest dance hall artists out. Run your run, so me like it. Sheets, spice, run this island. So I'm sure she gonna show us a good time. <laughs> spice song comes on on the radio, and now I'm really hyped. We're rolling with a local celebrity and a twerking fool. I'm not thinking about Stevie, baby mama number five, her bestie Melissa. Carly probably won't be thinking about Jock. Tammy probably not going to be thinking about Walker. Dom, she probably will miss her boo, but guess what? She'll be all right. It's just going to be a girl's trip. We are here to be saw, and that's just what we're going to do. Me, do you want to see the goat? Uh, yes, is there a goat? That's a dog. That's a goat. That is not a goat. That's a dog. That's a goat. <laughs> Mimi. Mimi doesn't know it, but I got her here a day early just so we could get more of the uncomfortable things out of the way. Mimi, you gonna eat out all the jelly? Cut it in half. Yeah, I have to drink it. I gotta chop. So this is the jelly, so you eat all the inside. Suck it, Mimi. Suck it. <laughs> <laughs> Melissa gonna be here tonight, too, to hash some things out so they don't spoil the trip for the rest of us. So we have a lot of things to do, because I have a show you girls have to come. I'm looking forward to Spice's show, the sexy beaches, and most of all, the Jamaican sunshine. Uh, we're here. Do they have a naked beach here? Oh, hard. No, not here. some much needed turn up. No men and no drama allowed. Spice invited us out to one of her shows and clearly Carly has been waiting to let loose since we've been talking about this trip. Give it up for my friend Carly! Carly said she wanted to come on this trip and be good because she just got into a relationship with her new man. But when Carly got up on that stage with all that work, good luck girl. Lord, child. <laughs> yeah, that was great. That, that was, was great. Oh okay, so y'all know that's my culture. That's why I'm so sexual, you know? We saw you. I ain't no lazy sex at all. That's my jock ass is going crazy. Ooh. He ain't going that crazy, otherwise he wouldn't be cheating on me. With everybody in the world. So maybe we just need to talk about something else now. <laughs> I need to play the bitch. <laughs> Damn, man. <laughs> What the hell is Jock doing here? He will follow Carly to the ends of the earth. 
even though she treats them so bad. Hey. Hey. What's up, Carla? But what I'm trying to figure out is why he got this hood rat treasure on his arm. Is Jock playing a game? Why would you come here and ruin our trip? Why you gotta be so thirsty? You gotta swim across the ocean yet to get here. Just stop hating for a minute. In all of the dance hall clubs, in all of the Caribbean islands, why is it that Jock is standing in front of me and my girls? You know why? Because he's a stalker, that's why. This man done swam across the ocean with some dusty ass chick on his arm just because he can't leave me alone. This treasure with me, my intern. Intern? What you can pay her? You can afford to pay her? Intern in Jamaica. It ain't nothing like that. He it's invited cool. me because we had a little altercation and he thought that the best way to make up was to come and be peaceful. No disrespect to you, but this man is a hoe. What's all the animosity? I thought you guys were together. Here's the thing with me. I come in peace. Everybody at this table know Jock cool. I, I rock with everybody. Yes, Trez and I are trying to get back on track, you know, to kind of work out our differences. But she's really here because I knew it would make Carly go crazy. Home girl invited me to her grand opening just so she could get back at me by bringing her new man, Caesar. So I'm just trying to let her know that I'm moving on. Where are you? You remember me from a strip club, y'all? Yeah. Oh, you the one that got into it with Tommy. Yeah. She had told me that, like, you guys that got into it because you were, like, talking about how you like sleeping with married men or something. I didn't say that I like sleeping with married men. I explained to her I did deal with a guy before I moved here, and then he told me he was married way after our relationship had been months and months. I no longer deal with that guy. Sure, Treasure. Last time I met this chick, she was practically bragging about messing with a married man. But if telling yourself that you didn't know he was married when you were dealing with him helps you sleep better at night, then by all means, you gotta deal with God, not me. But this is so weird. Like, we all in Jamaica. I'm really here with some of my partners. I came to support my guy. Guys, that's it, you know. Oh Stay in your lane, hands up. Stay in your lane, hands oh, up. Shit. Stay in your lane, hands up. So let's go, hands up. Bow, 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 bow. Walker told me that he had a show while I'll be out of town. How convenient that his show is here in Jamaica. I don't know if it's the most obnoxious thing he's ever done or the most romantic thing you've ever done. Big dog, big dog, big dog, big dog. My people spin like a big dog. Hold it, hold it, hold it like a big dog. Big dog. Me and the fellas on a little mission of love or revenge on Jock's case. I don't know how these girls go feel, but I know my wife will love it. I love the gesture and everything, but it's like it's supposed to be a girl's trip. Like, you just can't pop up on girls' trips. I don't give a my wife there. I don't just pop up on your trips. You can't. It ain't like you just a problem. Clearly, he doesn't understand my independence or boundaries. But I ain't gonna lie, it's kind of sweet that he came all the way over here to show me that he loved me or whatever. But I ain't gonna let him know that, so I'm acting like I'm mad. I didn't say you kiss? could. I didn't say you could kiss me. I'm finna get me some. I didn't you did the hell of you was. Look, so uh -huh. Walker just appeared and surprised his wife. What? Oh, you know what that means? I think y'all should talk. Right behind you. Time to go. You're, uh, you're not gonna talk to him? You rolling? I'm going with you. I'm tired. You're not gonna I'm talk out to him? Nope. Let's go. Kurt won't take a damn DNA test, but he wanna pop up in Jamaica like I wanna see his ass. Boy, bye. What happened? Yeah, I tried. She ain't him. She ain't him. It's all good. I'm gonna handle it. I know Rashida told me not to come around till I take the damn test, but I'm here anyway. I got a few ideas that I want to run by her if she can hear me out. I ain't even tripping. We're gonna talk, don't even worry about it. All right. I'm sorry for <laughs> y'all. Look, we're gonna cut this short. Let's go. Ain't nobody got time to be playing with these little boys. I know Jock just bought treasure here just to get me riled up, and I'm definitely not gonna get him the satisfaction. I hope these two trolls have a wonderful vacation. You made the whole party stop. I guess I did. I'm sorry. Spice put on a fantastic show last night, and it's a shame it was spoiled by some uninvited guests. But we came here to have a good time, and that's just what we're gonna do. Spice invited all of us to a day party, including the guys. Tammy and Rashida said it was okay, so I guess it's cool. Let's go over there. I think your friends are over okay. there. Okay. For the first time in forever, I have a real boyfriend. 
And everybody else's man crashes the trip but mine? Man, this got me feeling some type of way. But we better turn up at this all-white day party. What's up, guys? Hey! Oh, you turn it off! Kirk saying he's gonna take the DNA test is a good thing. I'm not happy that Kirk just popped up in Jamaica, but I am grown enough to enjoy a party and not let our personal problems get in the way. Guys, I'm planning a boat party tomorrow. Just the is girls. it just the girls or the no. guys? I see y'all men and crashed the trip. Girls crashed. Like semi trucks collisions. You know we all want to jump on you. Let's just get it out of the room. Yeah. We all jump on you. Yeah. 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 Jump on Walker ass too. But well, Walker, you're doing a really great job. I'm really proud of you right now. Thank you. I'm glad that you came. Now, Jack, I don't know what the hell you doing here. I came to support my dogs. I believe in love. You know what I'm saying? I ain't really got the best love story, but I believe in it. And when I can see it, I can see it. So I just really want y'all to continue to nurture what y'all got for the future, man. Hats off to y'all, you know what I mean? So Jock is here as Kirk's wingman? And then he bought a date to help him out? I already know Jock is here on some get back since I surprised him at the grand opening with C's. But guess what, Jock? It didn't work. At least get somebody other than the help. Kirk, even though I want to strangle you, I'm still happy that you came too. I appreciate that. I really am. I, I need I some mean, support. 17 years is not easy to throw it's away. Not. So, Rashida, bitch, you know I love what? you. You know I got your I back. Love you you want to jump him, we're going to jump him. Okay. <laughs> but that's right. Just enjoy yourself while you're here, baby. I'm trying. Luckily, he ain't at the bottom of the ocean. Right. So, y'all, everybody knows I'm Jock assistant, of course. And like, from me to Rashida, you know what I mean? I was formally dealing with a married man. It don't matter. That, that's in the past. But at the end of the day, like, I, I met up with Kiana, you know? Who's Kiana? Kiana was the baby mama's girlfriend or whatever she was. What baby mama? I know Kiana from dancing in the club. She told me all about Jasmine and Kirk's drama. Side chicks get a bad rep, but at the end of the day, your story deserves to be told because it's the guy that makes the girl feel some type of way. It's not the side chick's vows, it's your vows. What's your name, boo? I'm Treasure. We ain't trying to go there with that one. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out where they're going. Well, I mean, Kiana was just like, Kirk made her feel like he was gonna take care of her, he was gonna wait, do wait, better wait, things wait, for her. Wait, 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 wait. Really? So y'all know this little Kiana name was all up in the mix with this situation with Kirk, but on some real I believe it was some bull I don't even know why Treasure would bring that up. How dare you even try to have a conversation with me about my personal business, bitch. You don't know me. I don't give a what the streets is talking about. You really think that's some appropriate to like bring that up right now, though? You speaking from a side bitch perspective. I was once a side bitch, whatever y'all want to call it. I'm being real because we all women. It's about women empowerment. It's about understanding. Uh, we, we all women. We, we all women. women. Oh. The first time I met this bitch, she was talking about dating married men. Ain't she got nothing else to talk about? Has she been elected president of the mistress gang? I blame you, Jock. You got us up. You know what, this one I'm a <laughs> exit, cause I'm, I don't. Nah, you ain't going no <laughs> then, I don't do you know bitches who no. don't. I know this home wrecking nobody did come up in our circle with this little $20 wig and airport flip flops Thinking she gonna disrespect Rashida and we gonna let it slide? She talk too much, bitch. She needs to leave. Goodbye. She yeah. do need to leave. Hey, no, she talking too bitch, much. It's an all, it's an all white party anyway, bitch. Why you Just for a play? funeral, bitch. Just for the Just funeral. For the... I gotta commend my girl dying for that one. Now y'all know I don't condone no violence, but this bitch had it coming. Let the wig fly. Why the f up? You a grown ass woman? Why the f and I beat your ass? Why the f up? Like your mama should have beat your ass. Jessica died. Good looking. No, I f with the team. You're not on our you level. We didn't even invite man. you. You can't talk to this lady about messing with her marriage. Are you crazy? Wow. I apologize. I put that on the radio how I beat your ass. She's talking way too much. Why you do that man? Why you let that watch your mouth? Man, I already fired Treasure at one time for getting my personal business. Now, I done rehired her. That was nice enough to even bring her ass to Jamaica. Now she getting all of my partner them personal business. She clearly didn't learn a lesson. That wasn't your place. Yeah, you don't talk about y'all that sh like that, I though. appreciate it. That's, that's what you get for running in my f they don't know about. Hey, I, I, I ain't never for the mess, but that f will come, though, bro. That f will come. That bitch down here said, I'm here for all the side bitches. I just said what the f I have to say. Go home. What you mean? Don't be no option. Pull off. You always doing shit, bitch. You a hoe just like I'm a hoe, bitch. Yeah, bitch. Bitch, I'm the best at what I did, bitch. I never heard of you. Whatever. And I feel oh. Hold up. <laughs> Wait, her window came off. Hold up. It's 
Hey, Jock, what you doing? You better pick a side and stay there. Exactly. Jock. Jock. Let me hold Jock. the ring. Do it. Pick a side. Pick a side, Jock. Trainer. <laughs> I'm not a traitor, you know what I'm saying? I'm Team Rashida all day. I'm just trying to make sure Treasure get off the premises for somebody's scalp ass. I don't give a what y'all go through. At the end of the day, that's still your husband. Listen. <laughs> I was gathering up phones and purses and, and trying. What point was you trying to prove at the end of the day? I don't know you, you don't at know all. me. You don't know shit about me. You shouldn't even be here. Jessica, thank you. This, I'm going to get some butter for my lobster. And we need to continue this party. Let's party, let's party, 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 party. Yesterday was a hot mess. So I put together this boat ride so we could just chill and have one day on this island with no argument, no wig snatching, and no drama. I even told y'all I could get tag along. Hell, bring your thoughts. I have to feel bad for the man after his retaliation plan of bringing treasure along just to make me jealous. <laughs> Epic fail. And as long as he keeps treasure far away from us, no one's gonna get thrown overboard. Yesterday when Treasure came at you like this, right. it just made me mad. You walked off like, I was like, Fuck this, we ain't going out like but this. But you know what, I walked off and made a good ass opening for you to clock that bitch in the head. <laughs> <laughs> she was like, choose a side, Jock. But she was like, yeah, choose a <laughs> side. <laughs> Treasure's taking her ass back to Atlanta. I brought her along just to get on the Carly skin. Bad idea. Okay, my up. The whole time though, Carly like, it's Jock. <laughs> From here on out, I'm hoping that this trip is gonna be smooth sailing. I wanna make love. As a matter of fact, one of my homies got a surprise for Dime that's guaranteed to create a whole lot of love making. You dig what I'm saying? You were looking so surprised. Did you I was. But not more than this, though. What's up, pretty woman? <laughs> Sean is here. Here I was feeling all sad and lonely because everybody else's man was here. I should have known not to underestimate my baby. We on a boat, baby. How did you know we was here? Walk up, walk up, fine. <laughs> <laughs> and, 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 a, and a little help with the GPS. Yeah, yeah look. Bitch, no. I didn't even know they knew each other. No. Thank you, Walker. You're welcome. Well, I'm glad we That's what so that beef officially cooked, right? Oh, no, I'm glad we cooled down, bitch. Right. I want to thank everybody for coming to the party, to the boat party. We having a good time. Thank you, Sean, for making my girl happy. I was, I cried. I cried. When? I cried. I didn't see you cry. I did. <laughs> Listen, I cried on the inside. My heart is crying. But here's the thing. As a man, a real mother man, all the shit you done put me through, you could at least apologize. Carl, I've been thinking about this a lot lately. Been a lot of lonely nights. My if you don't apologize, I'm gonna throw this motherfucking drink on you. You're gonna I'm be mad as shit. And I thought about that shit and I was like, nah, I'm gonna make a wait for it. But tonight, you're gonna get this tonight. <laughs> I already know Carly's not thinking about Caesar, because I already know later tonight, while we on this little island, she will come knocking at my door. I'm happy that we can all finally come out to a trip. To Jamaica, man. one more day in Jamaica, and despite the rough start, we actually had a great time. And tonight, Walker put together a little something special for me. He booked a private piano room to hear my music for the very first time. I've supported Walker many years in his career, and it feels good to know that I have the same support in return. So that yes, song... <laughs> Yeah. Uh, of course, y'all know who that was inspired by. <laughs> My baby got a beautiful voice, and I can't wait till the world hear it. 
She the best mom I know, bomb ass wife, and now she gonna be a star and I'm here for all that. It's time for her to live her life and I ain't gonna never do anything to drag her down. It is just, you know, the life of the struggle and real talk. I mean, regardless we go through what we go through, but if this go down, we both going under. That's right. And you stay down. I like the message. Oh, you like that? I said Kirk feeling this over there. So he is. <laughs> To see Tammy and Waka together like they are is totally inspiring. And in the perfect world, that could be me and Kurt. I do love him, but as of right now, I don't know what direction I'm going in. Once he gets this DNA test, I may be able to get a little clarity. I think the music is beautiful, baby. I'm proud of you. I'm overwhelmed. Why are you overwhelmed? Because it's about me. Yeah, because I had to let some of that shit out. I done been through too much with your ass. I'm sorry you had to do it that kind of way, but... That's okay, because the whole EP is about your ass. Everybody gonna know uh, I've been. Uh, <laughs> I'm excited that everyone loves my song. There is love after disappointment. And I want the new birds, the new couples like Sean and Don, to know they're signing up for the good and the bad. But if the love is there, I promise you it's worth it. How long y'all been together? Uh, How long been together, baby? Forever, ever. Aww. Forever, ever. We need some dates. Ever, ever. Yeah, how long y'all been together? Yeah, we, got, we ain't drinking well, We've been yet. together, we've been knowing each other, what? Over 12 10 years. years. Yeah, your 20. mama taught me. Your mama was his teacher. Oh, this is the perfect love story. It is. Oh. Seriously, like, we've been going back and forth for a while. Oh. Yeah, your right name is that real now. It's just us. It's real okay. now. Yeah. That's what's up. Yeah. Like my other half. You're complete. Yeah. So it's just perfect. Well, you know, we're gonna make it our way complete. You remember this right here? You gonna do what? You remember this? Yeah, your grandma thing. My grandma thing? Well, we're gonna do it. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. You mad me, sweetie? Yes, baby. I gotta take this one out. Give it to me, sweetie. <laughs> I'm about to cry. <laughs> Never in a million years did I think that I was gonna come on this girl's trip and get engaged. I just feel like everything is complete, that everything that I've done for myself, being independent, that he saw it and he just wanted to make me his better half. And I just feel so good at this point and I'm so happy to become Mrs. Williams. Tell you how fast it was. We were together, what, three days? We drove back to Atlanta. We wrecked the Rolls Royce. <laughs> Third day, we hit a, my friend hit a wall, right? Yes. It's all the way around the expressway. I was so worried about her, never worried about the Rolls Royce. You know what I mean? I looked, that's when I knew I loved her. I was like, babe, I just wrecked the $500,000 kind of car. I'm asking you, is you all right? Are you all right? You straight, Aww. you know what I mean? And um, from there, I just knew, you know what I mean? I've been new. She a real woman, you know, you. godly woman. You had my back, so I got yours, sweetie. Gosh. This has been the most romantic <laughs> trip of my life. Yeah. I am so happy for my girl, Dom. We all out here looking for love, and guess what? She found it. I guess you never know when the right one's gonna come along. All you could do in the meantime is just keep playing a romance game and just hope that nobody stomps in your heart. <laughs> so we're clear, Jock did not give me the D last night, and I didn't want it, but I didn't get my apology either. But we only have one more night in Jamaica, so I think it's time for me and Jock to leave whatever we had going on and focus on the future. Now I'm very happy for y'all, man, and to see everybody so happy. You know, I, I, I'm not always um, right, Carly, but as a man, I was just gonna take the time to apologize for all the I've never put you through so we could lay it to rest. Congratulations, Mr. and Mrs. Mrs. Williams! Yes! But you know, so many things flipped and turned, and ultimately, you know, we need to toast to them. Jamaica, me. Hey, 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 hi, couples. How are you guys? Hey, we were just talking about all you guys. Hey, y'all. Trying to stay warm and stuff. Hey, guys. Kirk and I have been planning this cabin trip, and the
the day is finally here. The trip to the Dude Ranch last year helped me and Kirk reconnect as a couple. So this trip to the cabin is set up to help our friends improve their own relationships. Y'all ready? Yeah. So it's just the eight of us? I did invite Carly, but her and her boo then got into it, so I'm guessing she ain't coming. <laughs> Child, I don't know. I was just oh, like, you know what? Guy, it's cool. Man. It's that Carly. I thought they was getting married. Oh, wait a minute. Here come Carly with damn Shekana. She ain't even got her damn man with her. Hi, y'all. Hi, y'all. How y'all doing? Hello. Hey, what's up, Carly? 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 What's up, Okay, so look, I had initially had it set up to where guys ride in one van and girls ride in the other, but since we're a little off on the numbers, does anybody want to volunteer to ride with the guys? I will. Oh, you want to be with your boo? I ain't spent no time. So. Oh, shut up! Yes, Definitely we not. We need some time. Really? Been on baby. Yes, Going been on Baywatch. Now. I am so happy that my baby Breland is here, but the struggle of being a new mom is real. So when my mom offered to babysit, I had to take a little break and spend some time with my husband. Thank you for bringing me on y'all look. I'm sure. Of course, you're my best friend. I didn't even think you would come. Because I know you, you know what I'm saying, got things going on or whatnot. What's going on? Carly, you haven't told me anything about this. No offense to, to you, Kendra. But, you know, like, I really don't know you. So, I mean, you know, it's not that I'm not trying to open up in front of you, but... I understand. I can't wait till we get to this cabin, girl, because you better feel me in. Dude said he had to go home and check on something. What? What do you mean, check on something? Like, he might have had an egg in the hatch coming what? from a different direction. Right? Wasn't it something like that? I don't know. That's what I might have took it the wrong way. I think you took it the wrong way. I mean, situation. I thought he was talking about prison or like jail time or something like that. What made you think prison? Cause he was cut listen, bro, he did like this. I gotta go take care of some shit. and the way he going and he looked down, I said, oh wow. So Kirk think the man Mo is possibly dealing with a baby mama. Scrappy think the man facing prison time. But all he really said was, I've got to get ready to go to Arkansas to take care of some business down, so. I'm starting to feel like Kirk and Scrapper are projecting their own problems. So how long you and um, Jock been dating? Two years. Wow. Girl, that's interesting. Uh, off and on, no? No, 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 we been together. Like, we ain't, ain't been no off. <laughs> It's just kind of weird because just last year when we was at the cabins, Jock and Carly was, was like... Messing around. Okay, okay. Okay. This news to me. Okay, so let me just clear the air. Jock and I did not have sex on the cabin trip in Houston, but we did flirt, we did, you know, hug, we did kiss. Just asking if y'all kissed and said no. I will say this, we did get a hotel room one time, and his d was out. He was begging me to f and I said no. See, this is why I wanted to meet the women in Jocelyn's other life. I was wondering if I would get a different set of events than I got from Jocelyn. And bingo. Let's change the subject. Yeah, so, I mean, relationship go through things, so I just hope this cabin trip brings us closer. I once was a man that liked a lot of women. Yeah. But I've been thinking about forever, like, yeah. lately, you know what I mean, with this girl, like, I bought Shorty a ring. What? Dope. So I'm getting, I'm getting it built from scratch. And I'm not just saying that we about to get married next week. I'm just saying I'm giving it another shot. And we just gonna see where it goes. Sarah, I don't wanna rain on your parade, and I want you to be happy with BK. But that sh that happened in Cancun, this text that I got from Pooh about her and BK, that sh ain't cool. Her and BK what? Pooh sent a text that they, he hit on her, and she was accepting it, and they was. Bitch, you lying. No, dead serious. Look at this sh So. I ain't trying to be funny, though, but pull top, pull right around, say that shit, I'm you. Which is a whole lot. She says you her butt. Oh, Carly. Let me tell you something. Tell me. Number one, I would never that bitch if she was the last bitch on earth to yes, she Number one, say you act like she was Number the last two, bitch. No, 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 bitch. <laughs> she said she was hungry like it was the last meal. Oh, my. <laughs> 
on my daughter's life. I ain't never fed that bitch. Well, on that note, we here. Let's talk about this inside, because we here, bitches. Yeah. Oh, this thing ain't lit like this, huh? It's a cabin, cabin. I'm just looking for the Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi. Oh, cabin. <laughs> oh, it's nice. Oh, yeah. oh, this okay. Is nice. This is nice. It's yes, here. It is. Rashida, you did a good okay. job, girl. Rashida, you cute. Is there beers up here? Was, no, not yet. Yo, this is dope. This is way better than Texas. All the rooms is labeled, too. You're a cabin expert, too. Oh, no. <laughs> Definitely oh. cabin expert. <laughs> now it's time to chill, relax, have some drinks, and talk about some relationship stuff, and hopefully mend it back together, because it's falling apart. I bet we're gonna have the weakest room with some crazy. No, we're good. Let's see what it look like. Oh. Okay. What the hell is this? It's two sinks. <laughs> That's all that matters. <laughs> oh. Rocks. What if we toss and turn and then it move? You think yeah, it's cool? Yeah, toss and turn and then it move. Okay, well, we don't have to put it up. I'm just saying. I'm just trying to let you know. Oh, my God. 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 Oh, my What's up, man? We coming to New Yorker. What's up? Oh, God. Oh, wow. Yo, if I knew I was coming out to the woods to be sleeping on the couch, I would have said thanks, but no thanks. And now that I'm here, there's really nothing I can do about it. OK, so did everybody sleep good? Did yeah, everybody sleep I slept good? really good. I slept with, on the couch. <laughs> we know. This is why I'm single. OK, you guys. So I want to do this exercise where we say one thing we love about each other, and one thing we don't like about each other. Mm. Okay. 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 As far as I'm concerned, me and Kendra did all the relationship building uh, we needed to do last night. Yeah. And you know what? That bed, that bed really does rock. I mean, it was. So to break the ice, we'll start first. Kurt. Okay. I love your uh, business sense, but it's your timing. You always late. <laughs> okay. Well, let me say this about you. You are undeniably supportive and have my back, but I don't like, I mean, you know, situations that happen and stuff, never make that happen again, or you shall no longer <laughs> be on this planet. Wow. Yay! Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 The planet! Next up, Scrappy and Bambi. Well, what I love about you is that you're a great mom. Oh. What I don't like about you <laughs> You got to start giving me some credit around it, bitch. You know what I'm saying? Oh. Like, You're saying I don't give you enough credit? Yeah. OK. You need to be more grateful. OK. Well, what I love about you is, um, Clearly, you're a great father. What I don't like, I don't like the fact that you you eat in the bed. Wings, like hot wings with the, the red stuff. And Why you got to tell them the type of food I eat in the OK, next. Sierra and BK. Oh, uh, what you got to say, BK? Uh, I love that you love my family and my kids like they was yours. What I don't like about you is that I slept on the couch. OK, so my turn. The thing that I do love about BK is that I was in a really dark place in my life. Like, I was depressed. I didn't feel beautiful. And he came in and just, like, gave me light again. He told me I was beautiful every day. And um, I appreciate you for that. But the things that I don't like about you is just, like, you do things, like the pool situation. That's what I hate about you is you're not considerate of my feelings. I can understand what Ciara's saying. I haven't been perfect, but she can't deny that I'm trying hard. Truth is, I love this girl, so I'm gonna continue to try to make it work. All right, now that we've got past that, we're gonna roll it on over here to Jock and Kendra. So the thing that I love about you, Jocelyn, you treat me like fine china, and I love that level of care and love that you show. That's so sweet. Now, I don't like the, the punctuality. I want you to just have like a, a greater sense of urgency with just being on time. All right, I gotta say this about you, Kendra. I love the fact that 
You like this superhero. I've seen you in court, and I've seen you sit there with somebody so vulnerable, and when they follow your lead, they win, and they walk out their courtroom. So when I see that, I'm like, that's my little hero. You know what I'm saying? Nice. For real. So it ain't too much I don't like about you, because I allow the good things about you to yes. overpower that yes. You know what I'm saying? That's mm. real. It crazy, because I feel like that my family. I, I wanted to say that too. <laughs> 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 And with that being said, y'all, let's get these dishes, ladies. Jock and Kendra. Now, I saw y'all getting into it with Carly earlier. As a matter of fact, you know what? Let me go get her ass so we can get this all squared away. Just like every other couple, I'm sure Jock and Kendra have their issues. Part of the problem is Carly and this information she decided she wanted to volunteer. And since this is about communication, Carly should be here to clear up the she was saying about Jock and Kendra's relationship. We all gonna go through We all gonna have issues. At the end of the day, that's all a part of it. I know, but I just, I just rather go through stuff with my mate without somebody creating that drama. You know what I'm saying? True. I'd rather just up. Ain't nobody creating Carly. Don't bring my name up and don't bring you my up. You be miserable as Oh, oh no, bitch. I'm not definitely so not miserable. Like, you You're messy. You said timeline. Mm -hmm. And you, you asked a question. You was like, you and where's Shekana? We was all in the car and I asked the question. I said, how long have you and Jock been dating? Been together. You said four years. I said, well, Carla, how long y'all with you? I said almost five. At the end of the day, I'm, I'm not going to play no childish game with nobody in this room. I don't have to, Especially you know, people say me. name drop. What, what, what? Chill. Especially not me. <laughs> Stop. I don't hey, have to name out. drop. No, I move these two people from in between. Uh, okay. On okay. some real <laughs> Real Hey, bitch. Jump yeah, out. Let's go. Stop. 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 Trick you? Period. Quit talking like you ain't got no sense. You got a big ass vocabulary. That ain't begin to start when you start. Why are you defending Crazy. her? Attacking? I'm defending That's you. Crazy. And what the f you got going on? Mm -hmm. Hey man, I could be good. For I'm good. I don't give a f whichever way. Wait, Jock, Jock. No, come on, y'all. Come on, Jock. Come on, Jock. Y'all, let me know why I'm not in a relationship again. Thank y'all. I know y'all sick of me, but we got one more thing to do. Can everybody come over, please, with your mates and join me at the table? So this last exercise I wanted to do is about us putting everything behind us. Oh. We're gonna get crafty for two seconds. I wanted us to make some little paper bows. We're gonna write what we're letting go on that little boat, and then we're gonna set it a sail, and we're gonna leave it here and let it go. Y'all down with that? Yeah. Okay, so you fold it, you fold it in half. I've endured some of the craziest things that I never even thought would happen in my life, but I'm still here and I'm still standing. So I've let go of all of my anger, and I've also let go of the ridiculous expectations that I can't control in my life. And that's what I want for all these couples here today, to understand what's in front of them and not think that the grass is greener on the other side. Everybody finished? Yep. All right, let's get our jackets on and let's go inside. Okay. Okay, y'all, so my message is bad communication and hurt. Mine is being lazy and then causing pain. I don't want to cause any more pain. I want to let go to hurt, the pain, the distrust, and I want to add one, lateness, because y'all know I'm always late. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. You got yeah. it. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> let it go. I know that this is just a silly little paper, but I'm going to let this meaning weigh heavy. We're just going to call this little paper boat the first step to getting back to me. What I'm going to let go of is procrastination and anger. I'm going to let go of fear. I'm gonna let go of temptation. The drama this weekend could have put an end to me and Kendra, but we just had to come to an agreement that we would never ever let other people get the best of us. So right here, this is where I'm letting go of my fear that this relationship is gonna end like all the others. All right, BK, come on. I'm trying to get 
going to let go the unfaithfulness. Because you ain't got a drop of faith you know in your body. Sierra, come on. All right, y'all. Y'all came together. Y'all lead together. Exactly. What I'm letting go is, I just, I really want to let go of not knowing how to forgive. Yes, OK. That's right. All right. All right. Okay. I need to figure out if I can forgive BK for poo and everything else in the past. But even if I learn to forgive, I don't know if we can get through this. I'm gonna let go of my anxiety. Okay. And also this baby weight. <laughs> I heard that. Damn. Even though I don't see that. I don't see okay. nothing. <laughs> I'm letting it go negativity. Yes. And the crumbs in the bed. Eating in the bed. <laughs> All right, child. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> All right, and last but not least, me, Shekana. <sighs> Come on, boo. Yes. So, <laughs> I am letting go not being able to forgive myself for dumbass decisions that I have made in my life. Oh, okay. Right. Yes, because I've been holding a lot of anger with myself. So, I'm forgiving myself today. See you God bless you, baby. You better go. Yeah. Okay, y'all feel good about that? Yeah. Like, real talk, it do feel good. It does. It do feel good. Well, I just want to say it. thank y'all for coming, spending this time with us on our 19-year anniversary. You know, it, it was a little tough, but at the end of the day, look at everybody. Like, this right here is right where it need to be. Y'all together right here, y'all together right here, y'all together, together right here. But... We together. <laughs> and we together right here. Yes. 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 Champagne. I'm on my way to Vegas. It's the Grammy Award. Spice has gotten nominated. Listen, it's early in the morning in the Queen. Mm. All of the time was behind me. Now we're <laughs> one of my favorite cities. Why? Because anything can happen in Vegas. <laughs> what better reason to step out, spend some money on me to look good, than to celebrate Spice's Grammy nomination. So y'all know exactly how I do it when I do it. Y'all, yeah. this is how we pulled off drop top legend in Vegas. Stacey, you do not play. Girl, Money Monster Sierra do it. This is my first time in Vegas, so I had to do it big. I got me and my girls a drop top Rolls Royce so we can cruise through the city looking hella pretty. This is how a bad bitch pull up in Vegas, okay? Oh. Oh, I don't know what I'm doing, y'all. What'd I do? The key might not be close. <laughs> Hope my weight don't fall off. It won't. Now, one thing about God, he do know how to hump you right on up. Here I am, trying to figure out how to to start this car, and I just ordered a Rolls Royce truck. How <laughs> crazy is this And we're heading to strip. Oh! Freshly divorced, I decided to switch up my look. I love myself so much more now because no, now I got get through it. I I'm like, I got through it, sis. I am divorced, but the ink hasn't dried yet. Now what we have to do is wait for our arbitrator to just finalize certain decisions before I actually have the nerve to act for 50% custody with the game plan of getting me to pay child support. However, which way this ends up, karma is real, and your girl is ready to just start to feel like me again. I deserve my mojo back. In Vegas, better give me that. We all have a conversation about any small thing, and it turns into a big ass argument, and then you start realizing we got some deeply rooted issues. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? All right, bitches, we're here. run around this bitch but I snake it up. Bitch, let's go get some shots. I mean, when I left Atlanta, me and Eric were still kind of just like we'll, on a we'll see type of vibe. So while I'm in Vegas, I want to have a good ass time. I booked us a cute little spot and all that we've been through, we need our little boss bitch palace girls only. Guess what I 
her the other day from Shekana. What you heard? So apparently she told me um, Medea walked in um, spices. Who the uh, is Medea, uh, bitch? Girl, you know Medea. Medea, the one I was messing with y'all. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So she's like, girl, guess what I saw? I was like, what? She's like, like what is my bitch? Guess what Safari walked in with? I walked said, in where? <laughs> spices event. Girl, Medea and Safari, she said they walked in together? Mm -hmm. Whatever is going on, I just hope that it stays over there and does not deflect me over here in any type of way, especially on this trip, because regardless of who Safari is effing, trust me when I say it is not my business. I, so let me tell y'all, Safari apparently walked in with her, which oh, I'm not surprised. so he just bored. OK, yeah. so He's on board let hell. me tell y'all bitches something. This is my first time in Vegas, but I'm not on the bullshit. We finna go to Carly video shoot. We the bad girls club this week. But put your mother good, good girls club hat on. Cause Carly just always wants to And anything might pop up and anything might happen. Everybody know that me and Carly was close friends. And I still to this day love her, but it's just always something. I just hope Bambi and Erica know that when we go to this music video shoot, that they should be on their piece of cues cause it's Carly. She always on board. She just cannot help it. Cheers. Cheers. So this is one of my most important weekend here in Vegas. Well, here I am at Carly's video shoot. I'm glad that Carly is just like me because the only way for women to get respect in this music business is to kick the doors down and to make it happen. If she says she want to shoot a music video in three days and she get it done, I'm going to show up. Hey, baby. Hi, girl. Well, I got some good news for you. Spice is here and she ready. But is she happy? <laughs> I must have thanked Spice like a million times about really making time to do this video. And Spice has been a trooper about making this song happen. While we're here, we got to get this done. She got mad stuff to do for the Grammys. She out here, she got interviews, she got performances. OK, I will get on the director and tell him. Yeah. Spice is ready. She got to go. Yeah. Hi, How are you? I am freaking Give proud of girl. you. Yes, the girls. The girls. The girls. And they're pointing. And in the same direction. <laughs> oh, the other? Let me see, let me see, let me see. Oh, girl, we can. <laughs> By the way, I've been a video vixen, so I understand what the younger girls are doing. I'm 58, so I'm grown and sexy. Let me show you. Get low, get low to the flow. Get low, get low to the flow. Yeah, yeah, it's video vixen, bitch, OK? Let's go. And use it. <laughs> <laughs> It feels so good to finally walk down the stairs and see the whole shoot. You have your dancers. I see lots of cameras and the brightest light of them all. Me. You in the video? Yeah, I think I'm supposed to be Carly's love interest. You're too lying. What do you mean? What are you for? They said Carly's supposed to be rubbing me, rolling me down, and making love to me. It's an egg. <laughs> Carly, this is a big moment for you. Why would you put a mess in the middle of your own video shoot? I don't understand. But why do you want to say in the video? What are you talking about? Why? Why are you just... Where you been? Please. Don't use that word around me. There's no wife. Sorry, what do you mean? It's done. It's final. What you like? Yeah. Last week. Court was last week. Since Spice's celebration party, we kind of paid for an arbitrator, so everything was done privately. That's why it wasn't a big whole public debacle. It cost a lot of extra money, but the divorce is final. It's official. There's just a couple little things that, you know, we got to wait to hear back on, like, what's the child support? No alimony. What property is mine? What property is split? And stuff like that. Like, this is a learning experience. And um, I just want us to co-parent and just keep it moving. Can we please shoot Spice? I wish we could shot her first, because she's hot in that outfit. All right, let's go. <laughs> Don't turn sideways. 
Oh, I see a bitch we don't like. Oh, Medea. No, yo baby daddy. My sperm donor. I see him. Where? Why, Why is he, he here? here? Why? What the f Are we at the right place? I wasn't expecting to see Safari in Vegas at all, especially not at my friend's video shoot. Is he a video vixen in this video? Safari, how you doing? We didn't know you were gonna be hey, here Jesse today. Jay. I almost thought for a second I was in the wrong place. I don't know, babe. I'm, I'm what just, do you know? I'm just working. I'm not. Oh, you working? With it. Yeah. You working, my girl? I'm not doing it. Okay, she's like giving us the Beyonce hand. Like, uh, I don't have time for this right now. Oh, honey, like we're here for Spice's Grammy nomination, not yours. Pipe down, honey. So why is my ex-husband here? Like, if she invited me, why would she invite me knowing this here? It's a method to it. Yeah, go down. Go down there? Yeah. We're about to get our y'all set. We're just can't hide our friends. Not only is Safari here, now we got Medea over here rubbing Safari down with some oils. I know we in a desert, but girl, like, you look real thirsty. What the f is going on? Is this a prank? I feel like I'm being punished. Let me show you what yeah. we got planned out here. OK, let's do it. We're in Las Vegas. All my friends and the girls are here. So we decided to throw a blue theme brunch party, of course. You know, I'm a feel about my blue. To celebrate my Grammy nomination. Hey! I got my eyes on the prize, and nothing's going to mess up my shine. First time in Vegas. This is your first time in Vegas, Sierra. Thank you guys for coming. You're always so supportive. Though. Absolutely. Girl, like, thank you for being humble still, because Carly was acting like she was nominated yesterday. <laughs> oh. So, like, I was trying to like what do you mean? Stop. support her and say, "Hey, Carly, what's up? We here." Hold on. But Carly did us like this. You know how we gave you yeah, hugs yeah, and yeah. love Why and all that? that. She was like, I like, think because she knew. Safari, why would she tell me so I have the option of deciding if I wanted to be a Because she man. said Safari gonna be her main man in the video. So yeah, I thought I that it was just what I'm saying. Yeah, if you're okay. gonna hire my sperm donor as a video vixen and I'm your friend, you should tell me and give me Not a Not sperm up. donor. Erica, I have stop this. I can't understand. Not sperm donor. What else is he? It's been almost two months. He don't even FaceTime his kids. So what do you mean him to take care of him kids? Stop right there. What do they call it in your culture? A waste man. Man, for go away. What? In my country, a waste man is somebody who does not take care of their kids. If Safari is a waste man, it's not a good look. Bitch, you two babies ready to accept your Grammy. You don't need to worry about none of this. I know. But I love you guys. I'm going to let you get to eat. I love you I'm going to get something to eat. I know I'm hungry. But I'll see you in a minute. All right. All right, girls. All the fucking man. What's up, bitch? Being nominated for a Grammy is one of the biggest awards in music. I'm so grateful Spice invited us because to celebrate this moment with her, this is a beautiful, beautiful thing. We are looking forward to having a good time. I'm super excited for her, and we praying for the W, baby. Look at you, Blondie. What's up? I'm divorced, yeah, girl. Coming. Are you serious? Yeah, like, I'm officially. Damn, bitch, you have as <laughs> <laughs> The, um, the lawyers to decide, like, the details financially. And right now, I just want to be the best mom to my kids. That's it. Hey, bro. Hi. Hey, everybody. Hey. Carly, you went so big on us yesterday. I, my feelings is correct. This girl, I had no time to do it. I was doing so much. Yeah, it was a big day for me. I can have I couldn't deal with no drama. Okay, but what about what can we deal with today? Because as 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 my friend, you owe me an explanation. We're talking as far as Safari being there, right? I mean, why wouldn't you tell me? He, why wouldn't you give me the heads up that you even invited? Right. I didn't think he was coming. Everybody know that Carly can basically do what the f she wants, stir the pot, and then hide her hands every time. It never fails. It's like, oh, what did I do? I didn't know. Oh my god. What happened? It's like, you knew exactly what you were doing, Carly. Stop with the He told me. He said, Carly invited me. OK, I don't have time for all y'all ganging up on me right now. You know I'm not ganging up on you. We can talk one-on-one. I'm definitely not ganging up on you. The only person you owe an explanation to is me. 
So let's go over here. Everybody's ganging up on me. And I don't feel like I did anything wrong. I didn't invite Safari to, to be mean to you. We're all in the same social circle. Jock is always there. I really wanted, when I invited him, I said, you know what? He said that y'all didn't talk and y'all not talking. And I said, you know what? I know he wants to be with you. And I figured, okay, you know what? Me inviting him to Vegas. He could just what see you, y'all could talk. This man, who wasn't at a bedside of a woman that's carrying his first son. Right. I didn't know it was that bad for y'all, like that bad. And I was like, how do you not know? See? I done confided in you, and you yeah. done helped me and gave me advice on my divorce because you just went through one. Right. How do you not I, know? I, I just want y'all to be together. You know, Carly, do you understand this? What this man done put I me through? That. First of all, mm. her reasoning is stupid and it's trash. You can't put your friend in a situation like that and then want to cry and say you want her to save her marriage. Just take accountability, you f***ed up, because you know damn well you can't pay me enough money to get back with this man. Mita, you was rubbing Safari down yesterday. I felt triggered and irritated because... But why? Because everybody's like, saying she don't want it. She don't want no, nothing to do with because Safari. Because at the end of the day, them people going through a divorce. We never really got introduced, and you don't know my story. No, no, you don't know no, my real story. When I first talked to you, you were very pleasant, right? We talked on FaceTime. But every time... Sierra, let me talk. Listen, you know what it feels like when somebody's, everybody's yelling at you and nobody even listens oh, to what up, you have to say? Shut the up, bitch. Shut the up. You don't have like no morals. I saw Safari walking down the street with his girl holding hands. Well, girl, That's, I'm not the issue. I was walking by on the strip in Vegas, and I saw Safari walking by with another woman holding hands. So I'm not your problem. You're worried about the wrong thing. Safari is here with his woman. Please don't take it out on me. I'm talking. I just I'm talking. To I'm talking to my friend. OK, well, I mean, it wasn't that serious. I really it is that serious. That I'm talking to my friend, not talking to you. OK. You can so far. I don't want to. I have nothing to do with that. I promise you. Bro, I have nothing to do with him. I don't care. Okay. I have I, nothing I, against you. Do I don't, what you're not going to no, do, no. though, is disrespect me or my friends. But you only know one side of it. You don't know the other side of I how mean, she always comes at me. You got to remember, Kendra is our friend. So just like if it was the other way around, wouldn't you want your friends to be a buck about the woman that you know is your friend's man? So I didn't, I'm not him now. I'm not with him, I don't care. But they always up in my face asking me questions. If you don't know me, you, you are the side bitch. You who's gotta a, expect a, to be who's questioned. Who's a side bitch? Who's a side bitch um, for your what? Jocks is um, your Honey, I've never been no side Listen. bitch to jock because I didn't know nothing but about you her. put a married if man, I'm, you're gonna always I've be never questioned. Never that Jack was territory. Never, never. never Jack that's your business again. Okay. Girl, you take pride in that. You even went back on the runway and gave us a row because you're the queen of the jungle of the side bitches. You took on that role. I don't understand why you're so appalled at me calling you what you already said you are. Let me tell you, I don't have sympathy for nobody. Okay. Well, Especially okay. after what I've been through. Listen. You know, bitches are smiling your face your man's Listen, the next day. I, I, so I done been there, done that. Your business is your as business. As far as I'm concerned, I don't care what you do with got his chick that he was Listen. walking down the street with. I don't got nothing with him, and that's Good all I wanted to him. say. To, that's all I wanted he to has, say. He has three of them he wrote Okay, well, story. I'm not one of them. And guess what? I just wanted to say that. You just, you know what's so crazy is you bringing that up and you're walking away. You see how weird you Where are, you though? going? You just contradicted yourself as a woman. What happened? Because you sat up here, oh, oh, they perceived me the wrong way. And what then you're happened? like, oh, I'm not one of the women that he's walking down the street with. Right. Bitch, I just finished telling you, I don't give a f about Safari. Yes, you and do. And what you want to shut the f up. Yeah, and, and, and then this is where I get real yeah. Don't play with me, Chicana. Do I'm not one of them, Chicana. I'm not one of them. Hey. I love you, but I'm not one of them. I'm not one of them either. Either. OK? I'm not one of them either. Come to bomb. 
I just feel like it's a disrespect for him to just pounce up with this girl. What if Erica was here? You're not just walking with this girl like, men, these men, you ain't had no business doing this to me, my brother. Hey, girl, I ain't got nothing to get. I don't know you. But you done show your ass today. You suffer. Why would you cut my with this new guy? I cannot believe this mother just bought this bitch up in here. And my crying so he brings drama my way. So, so, he ain't with his new girl. No, 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 no. His, his, his ex-wife is different. But, and I'm supposed to be that girl for him. Listen. Take over five seconds. You know that girl. I can't really support you. I don't want to cry, but I'm here for you. I've cried enough. I want to be happy. Can I be happy? Sure. Can I be happy, Shikana? That's what this is about, right? Shikana, thank you for having me. Hi, Shikana, nice to meet you. you. How are you? This is wrong. Erica would kill me. Okay, that's fine. Even though me and Erica fought earlier, she's still a friend of mine, and I still have her back. I can't be shaking this girl Kimbella's hand. Mm-mm, mm-mm. Who do Kimbella resemble? You know I ain't in it. Oh, you didn't want to be in it, Gemini? Hey, guess what? Nah, me, me. I'm just okay. in my way. <laughs> You're beautiful, though, but you look like Erica. I ain't never gotten that before. That's crazy. Yeah, I have a lot of similarities. Wow, maybe because we're the same nationality. All black people don't look the same. Okay. <laughs> Did you see the ass on that? <laughs> Yo, that's Erica's twin sister. <laughs> <laughs> People said this moment wouldn't even be possible. And I did it. I made it. I came from humble beginnings and I keep repping my slogan from homeless to greatness. So it feels good. I know I'm a huge inspiration to a lot of women. You can say we're full of ourselves, but I don't know nobody else. With our hunger and no wonder why so many people like us. Everything now feels surreal. I mean, I'm walking on the carpet, the paparazzi, everyone is trying to get my attention. Spice, 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 over here, spice, spice. I'm living my dream. And baby, you can't deny it. I came up in best dress. And the grin goes to Los Lobos. for you. because it's about our relationship as mother and son. Well, I want to talk to you because I felt like, like, you're my son. 
I think you was very mistreating of me. Oh, my mother hurt me every day. I don't. You know what I'm saying? You when you when you speak when you speak lies or you speak stuff that's not coming from my mouth. You do things and you don't apologize because you cuss me out in my face. I never did I you like you did, you did me and my street. sister when we was kids. Yeah, I cussed my mom out, man. You know what I'm talking about? Man, you deserve it. You know what I'm saying? I feel like mom do deserve it. I mean, she always messing with me and Bam, but at some point, enough is enough. You know, this is not normal. Like, regular moms don't do this. And after this, it's going to be a real big battle because I came from a broken home, and I'm trying to break this generational curse. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to have something new happen, something real happen. Who always been the gratefulest kid and told you I appreciate it. You were grateful until exactly. a year ago. No, I just don't take disrespect from my mama because she I'm comes. I'm disrespectful. You always disrespect. I'm like, not like, I grew up in that. I grew up in that. Listen, I grew I'm up. I'm not perfect. And they total. Oh. oh. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I grew up for real hard. You know what I'm saying? Mama was a pimp. You know what I'm saying? So me and my sister was raised around whores and crack pipes and this is what you see and this is what you find and there's gunshots going on. I thought it was normal. Say, I'm not gonna ever try to mm. manipulate no situations to f my kids up. I don't. You do. No, I don't. You I do. tell your truth. But you're not, it's not on you to tell my truth. That you tell your own damn truth. You don't even know I all don't my care, truth. Don't you you don't even know all my like truth. That. You don't even know but all you my don't truth. Talk to me like I talk, that. I talk with respect. I'm no, saying all this with respect. Did. Go I said, yeah, I'm gonna sit right uh, here. I certainly, uh, like, I'm talking to someone where I'm being a man. She's not respecting me as a man because she's yes, telling I me, am. you can't talk like, you can't say that to me. Who do you can? No, if you don't give respect, you don't get it. I don't I care who you, you are. I mean, how much stuff she tell me? Word. She said, she done told me you. That's disrespectful. I never because told you. Mama. I just can't, I ain't gonna. Yeah, but gonna but you know your mama crazy. crazy. No, no, no. But it, mama, okay. did you know you crazy? But I love you. You can sit you down now. You, you, you talking about hiding, I right? Hide, no, you bring all my stuff out. You can bring all my mouth. I don't lie. I don't pretend. I don't live yes, beyond my means. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Why? No, first of all, you ain't gonna talk to your mother. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. Right. What happened with what? Really? Oh, she really hurt, though. She really... I'm going to talk me and my sister hurt, too. Wow. I don't do that to you. I don't tell your okay. mother okay. business. I don't go out in the street and tell you who tell people okay, who you really is. Mama, did you hear how he feel, though? He say she be able to talk to you. You should be able to tell nobody what he say. You, you, yo, yo, hey, man. Mama, did For Best Reggae Album, the nominees are Atana, Gramps Morgan, Sean Paul. My kids are on the phone and I'm just taking deep breaths like this moment could really change my life. Soja, Spice. When you see my album come up on the screen, come like some box, some drummer beat in your belly. It's like, oh my God. And the Grammy goes to? So When they said soldier, I was like, wow. To be honest, I really thought that I would have lost to someone from Jamaica. I kind of, I was kind of taken aback a little bit. You know what? You were still nominated, and that's a big freaking deal. But, huh, on social media, dumb fans was going crazy. Hello, why Spice didn't win? And who are these people that won? No one knew. It's just... 
I just wish my girl would have won. Oh, my God, I'm so tired. Well, we're going to win it next year. Yes. Yes. Two, two. We're good. Go back again, two. right? All right, now let's get everybody knows. Now, let's get dressed so we can roll. Listen, tonight could not be more of a dub. Spice did not win a Grammy. To some people from Vermont, they ain't even from Jamaica. This is one weird ass situation. Oh, it's a theater. You said Ooh. what? Okay. Yeah. The Grammy just didn't give it to me. Yeah. Everybody could see the tension in the room between me and Erica, but at the end of the day, this is not about anybody's problems going on. This is all about spice. I'm not about to sit here and argue with anybody about anything that has nothing to do with spice and this Grammy nomination right now. To spice. Yes. To the queen. To the queen. Yes. to your room. Yeah, your name's on there. This is like an adventure type trip, so you have to like find the you gotta go find room your that your key work. <laughs> Rashida thing and bringing us out here in the middle of nowhere, Texas. We ain't even got cell phone reception out here, man. No bars. So is this place safe? Somewhere? I don't know. All right, so let's stop finding rooms. Go, I don't even know. What All I know is I better be real far from Carly Red or Paprika Cayenne, whatever her name is, okay? Or it's gonna be some real problems. Like, where are we? I need Wi-Fi. Somebody point me to the Wi-Fi. Right now, it's looking a little spooky. We're gonna see how this pans out. When I say I mean horse. Uh, this ain't quite what I expected, you know what I'm saying? But after all, just a little under a year ago, I was slick living in a tree house with the llama, so I can roll with the punches. It ain't that bad. Like where I'm from, we ain't got time for no side show. You 
get your ass boy where I'm from, Patty. Let's eat. Child time. Let's go. Thank you. Oh, this good, man. Real good. Congrats and for Sheeta. The grand opening, I must say, it was oh, like, I'm so you. proud of you. I'm so happy. You know, thanks for having me here. No I'm already having fun. Yeah, and again, since time. I'm really sorry I was not there. I apologize. I still love y'all. You just up took a free trip on their dime and just come to the grand. <laughs> yeah, she did. <laughs> she did this some I was coming to the grand opening, but I had a mishap before, so it was best that I stayed. A mishap. Oh, God, here we go. Tokyo has been chatting a lot of things before she even meet me. Cause Carly don't tell me she was talking trash behind my back. Spice, paprika, I don't give a who it is. All y'all. And then for come at me and I throw your purse, me and I are in a problem. I'm saying you know, people be real disrespectful. Disrespectful? Who was disrespectful? You! I wasn't disrespectful. Yes, you were. You threw your purse. Yeah, so because why you, you disrespected me. And I, I told disrespected you, you. I told you plenty of let times that straight. I did not no, have let me a get problem straight, with Tokyo. you. You so don't have a problem with me in front I of my face. I don't have no problem with you. You don't have a problem with me because no, I'm, before I'm you met me, you told Carly that spice you never me. You and anybody who's dealing with him, that's how I talk. Carly Red is at it again. I started to wonder why do Spice have so much hate for Tokyo. It's because Carly been running her damn mouth. I'm not a hypocrite friend like your friend sitting beside you. I'm a hypocrite? Yes, you're a big hypocrite. What I do? You're a hypocrite. What I do? What did I do? Please tell it. We all in the open. At the end of the day, I was upset because after that stupid brunch, Sierra called me and told me that Tokyo was wrong for throwing that purse. But then she told Estelita that I was wrong for making comments about Tokyo weight. So which one is it? What? If I have a problem with you, I'ma say you it. Have, you had a problem with me before you, you met me. You've been saying me. behind and my you back. You had with me before you met me. Okay, guys. That's not a joke. That's not a joke. But it's a matter of respect. That's not a joke. Let's not do it. Let's not do it. Get lunch and a little show. Hey, but for real, for real, the last time these two were together, yo, bags went to flying, and I'm gonna keep it 100. I'm not trying to get knocked out. I don't know what kind of doctor they got out here in the middle of nowhere, so I'm getting out the way. I'm naturally aggressive. That's how I talk. Hey, is there a resolution? How do you solve the problem? I don't have no problem with her, but the bitch want to keep me. Sean. Oh, yeah, on it. Sean Gary knows a lot about horsepower, but I ain't gonna lie. It's my first time horseback riding. Be careful. Don't hurt. Okay. You got the biggest horse on the ranch. That's what she said. Ah, it ain't every day that I go horseback riding, but the ladies have told me that uh, I'm hung like one, so it shouldn't be that hard for me to fit in. Oh, uh, yeah, I ain't signed up for nothing like this. Oh, hold on, wait. Wait, Rooster. All right, let's go. When we go down this first hill, lean back a little bit. Lean back. I feel like I'm going to pray. I trust these horses more than I trust some of these people on this trip. We might have a little moment at the campfire, but don't think I forgot about BK trying to turn up on me.
my shop and my kids. Oh, oh, Everybody, can y'all hear me? There's a picnic waiting for us. So once we get off the horses, don't go separate ways. We're all going to the picnic, okay? All right. I don't think any of us have a future in rodeo, especially Sierra. The horse did not like her. Maybe he read my mind and knew exactly what to do. Oh, see? You was laughing at me? Hell yeah, yeah, my foot kicked your foot. That more went got down. I see you doing that, I'm like, pull back, come on. Seeing Carly ride that horse back, you know, brought back some real memories for me. But I am glad we had the opportunity to kind of just reconnect and kind of sort of, you know, smooth things out on this trip. Last night was crazy. Yeah, last night was crazy. I'm kind of glad that, um... We're finally back friends again, you know. I, mean, I hate I, that we'd be going through our I think you be going through the with me. Out of all my relationships, you hurt me the worst. Man, don't say that. It's so true. Well, I and apologize, because that was never my intentions. Like, real talk. You know, give me an apology party. Who says apology party and throw their ass in the circle? <laughs> God, Jack and I didn't last, of course. Because, I mean, like, Jock is the mayor of Dotsville. But I will say, we've always had fun together. Okay, okay. 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 Man, she been looking right. to get rescued, man. I'm glad I dropped off. No, no. <laughs> there you go. No, guys, we're not gonna do that. I'm just saying. Come on, come on, we just cool. Let them know we just. Please let them know we just smashed on the side of the hall here. Oh. All right. Okay, that's you. <laughs> Carly had an agenda on this trip. She basically thinks she's gonna get up under my skin and flirt with Jock, as if it's gonna bother me. You know, the brother ain't even bothered. Okay, so look, so this is the end of our excursion for today. Um, tonight is gonna be our last night, so everybody can go take a little chill pill, get refreshed. We're gonna have dinner and line dancing tonight. That'll end off our amazing Texas fun. Mimi? That's what we do. bring everybody together and just do something different. Have some fun together. And it's the last night of our trip, and look how far we've all come. Now this trip started off rocky as hell, but now we're all in the room together, line dancing and doing our thing. First thing I want to thank everybody from Silver Spur Ranch who made our experience amazing. Cowboy and cowgirl ready for this? But if I can learn line dancing, then it's only fear that they learn how to twerk. Can I have a real good time? Can I make this day go by? And I know you work too hard. So come and join me, shy. I'm from the Trinidad where I know everyone. I know Spice is in Africa doing her thing. So until she gets back, oh, I'm in charge. I want to make this a cultural experience before Spice and all of this Bacchanal stuff begins. Mimi couldn't make it out with us today. She had trouble finding someone for Eva. But she'll be here tomorrow. <laughs> Me and Kim 
to deserve a good time on this trip, especially considering our trip to the woods. That was ruined by Miss Carly Red, and we pretty much agreed that nothing else that Miss Carly says will ever affect our happiness from this day forward. They say that you get married in Tobago. I knew nothing of this. And look, the flight was long. Bitch, I'm stiff. Hey, Trinidad, what's happening, Jack? Everything looking beautiful around here, man. But I don't know what the hell I'm finna wear for the next couple of days, because my leg is gone. Outside. Well, yeah. hey, I'm gonna tell you somebody who's gonna end up being naked on this trip. Oh. Scrapping bad, but they lost their bags. Oh. oh. So, okay, the choice of drink in Trinidad is rum. The favorite foods in Trinidad is like roti. Okay. Roti is like a burrito. Y'all eat burritos all the time. So, roti is like a burrito, but then we put chicken in it. Anybody eat go go go? Yeah. Go 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 for your curry. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, no go. I understand this is Carly's motherland and all. But here she go, trying to dictate what we gonna do and where we going and what's going on. Don't she ever get tired? Carly, we're here for Spice Performance. Take me to the hood. Take you to the hood. Uh, you don't want to talk about the hood. That's not what this trip is about. Turn the heat from me. He ain't scared to go to the hood. I didn't say I was scared to go to the hood, Shekana. Never said that at all. I just said I don't want to take y'all to the hood. I want to take y'all where we're going to have fun. Since Spice is not going to be here to the day of her performance, she asked me to be the host. But Shekana Tokyo is just acting like they don't even want to be here. I can't really do too much. My knees hurt. My neck hurt. My hands hurt. Everything hurt. OK, well, I'm going to try to make it better. How you going to make it better? Because I'm going to make sure we have fun. To the hotel, I'm exhausted. Chicana and Tokyo Debbie Downers didn't help. We gonna enjoy Trinidad whether they like it or not. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Trinidad. Nice to see you, Carly. It's lovely to have you. You used to tell a friend of Carly Red, and Spice is coming to perform for Marshall Monday. What? So somebody's gonna get a complimentary sweet upgrade. Oh, great, it'll be me. Because my legs hurt. I hurt. I need to be able to stretch out. Wait a minute, we gotta. About this, can let it back cook it. And look, oh cause that's not fair. Wait a minute, stop. It's not paper scissors. This is what's going on. We were just at that cabin, and Rashida and Kirk took us to that cabin. Carla, hit me my damn key. I ain't go to no cabin with Rashida and Kirk. I ordered. Bitch, we had a long flight here. My knees ate and bitch, I'm fine. Y'all do deserve. Y'all been taking us on a lot of trips. You right. As always, I gotta. Team no. always gotta be some. Attached to it. Yes. Okay, no but since we here, we might as well make the best of it. You want the sweet, won't be no creep, and then Kurt ain't getting no heat. We're gonna be here all week. Oh. Man, I bad didn't get here to five in the morning, Jack. You know what I'm saying? But listen, I'm finna throw on my clothes, man, and go holler at the bros. I'm trying to see Trinidad. This monkey jungle thing is something Kurt wanted to do ever since we got Trinidad. So we at the hotel. They fooled Kurt. Then got a pamphlet and everything. Talk to the hotel people. So they give us these water bottles with rocks in them. And I can't even remember what they say. They bring them to you or scare them away. Bro, my question. The folk asked us, do we want a tour guide? Why do we opt out and not? Why are we here? Why are we trying to? Hold on. Hey, Kurt, I ain't with this girl, <laughs> dog. <laughs> Y'all trip with all this, man. Huh. <laughs> they call these monkeys red howlers. I don't need nothing red or nothing howling coming to me. I don't 
with the whole crew. Y'all the only one getting love. Like, I'm, I'm on here trying to, you know, you go out on the vacation, man, you both got down. Like how y'all doing, y'all hands spin. You done beat, you done skin down yet? Definitely. You done skin down yet? <laughs> that what I'm saying, Jock, Jock. jock. <laughs> Boy, you know I'm mine. <laughs> So you telling me you still? And we ain't talking about just on vacation, period, bro. We ain't did nothing to her. She give me every excuse, like we in high school, huh? I'm like, baby, come on, we're gonna go back. You know what I'm saying? Get the hotel. She like, no, I got all the girls coming over. You know what I'm saying? And we're gonna party, we're gonna go in the room and we're gonna talk about girl stuff. Let me tell you what you need. They got this little pump. Man, go ahead and on, bro. Oh, I ain't no pump. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> ain't no pump, bro. How you laughing, bro? I'm Come on, let's keep walking, bro. Like, uh, you know what I'm saying? I need some too naive before I be naive. You feel me? So what you gonna do, Scrub? What, tell me what to do, love, Doc Jock. You suck a toes? I don't suck them before. Have a couple of drinks. Rub, give a massage, you know, get the lotion. Make sure you hit a couple of the right spots. And you, you good. I feel for Scrapper, I really do. But he got to understand, man, Bama just had a whole human being with their own social security number come out of her body. Like, you got to give her a little time, cuz, just, just slow your roll. Oh, we in the game. That's dope. Yeah. Hush goodbye, hush goodbye. Come on. What's up, Jerry G? Right, it's cool. I saw the money. Y'all ready to go? We're start running. All right. The rain is coming down, fellas. The money is coming down, too. Um. So you know y'all tripped me out last night acting like me and Kurt don't be getting to popping around this night. Oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I just didn't know you was out of the doghouse yet, bruh. Oh, okay. I'm about to say that. You got me thinking I need to turn up a little bit more while we in Trinidad. Oh. 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 Yeah. Hi. Oh. Okay. Oh. Yeah, I wasn't yeah. getting none. You want more? Oh. I'll give you more. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, what are we doing today, y'all? Uh? We're going to go to my family's house to see my family. Who no family going to be cooking, though? Some of the island food? I hope so. I want some chicken feet, pigeon ass, wow. all that shit. Pigeon ass? <laughs> <laughs> Go get some curry goat. Tokyo Shikana and I, we may butt heads sometimes, but it's all love. At least Tokyo's cracking jokes and not complaining anymore. Y'all, they're gonna meet me doing her one way walk. Look, you better walk it out, bitch. I had some prior obligations in Atlanta, so I couldn't catch the same flight out with everyone else. But the timing was perfect, because while packing, I got a phone call and I ended up not having to fly out alone. I just want to let everybody know that I brought somebody Who with brought me. Ty? No, Ty's in Israel. Oh, hell no. Mimi. OK. <laughs> Hello. Shock look on their face. Hi, Shakana. Hi, Tokyo. Hi, Shock. Why she you? I invited Pooh because, because you guys have been friends for way too long, and I just at least wanted to see if you guys could clear the air. I don't even know what we arguing about, to be honest. Like, the is so silly and so petty to me, and we done been through so much together, like our families entwining. Pooh, I need you to confess that you lied that I ever slept with you and your husband, or you and your husband, and you and your uh, whatever. If you confess that, I'm good. We can move past this. Well, there ain't no priest here, so, you know, the confession, it is what it is. But you need to confess that I never, ever, because you know I never did. Whatever would make you sleep good at night, Carl. No, whatever, whatever would make you sleep good. No, no, see? Okay. This is what I'm talking about. I said talk okay, the truth. Okay, but we, we should do that. Truth? We want the truth. Okay, this is the thing. What is your issue with Cardi? She said, Right. Uh -oh. <laughs> she did not like. No, like. Oh, John, you know what I'm no, saying. Oh, uh, ain't no really no. The way you ain't the and the is so close together. But so she didn't technically. No, 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 no. Not like that. You see what I'm saying? Me and Boo never did nothing. So all of this, this whole discussion is about alleged sexual encounters that may or may not happen. I hugged the her in the. She. This is a gift from me to you. I bought you some diapers for that loose ass yeah. bottle. Oh my god. 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 Oh my god.
was gonna do right, make nice this time, but no. I wanted to salvage our clique's friendship, but I think it's time I waved the white flag with no on it. look like in a two-piece. Oh, everybody thinks this is a real party. Oh, no, no, no. Now that the sun's coming up, oh, this is when the party begins. I know y'all never seen nothing like this. as the sun is coming up. We've got fireworks, fire breathers. Jock and Scrappy are spraying the crowd with water cannons and everyone is getting drunk and getting there quick. This is crazy. Hey man, these people in Trinidad know how to pipe up, no cap. I'm not exactly sure what Kendrick went in all this mayhem, but hey, I'm having fun. Lots of beautiful sights to see. Up, but none of that includes my man pouring a drink down Pooh's ass. He has all these women around him, and I'm standing right here. Hey! Hey! Oh, we need to talk. These are the things that I always have to tell him about when I always preach to him. Perception, perception, perception. It is completely disrespectful. <laughs> Drinking. You was responsible for drinking that drink. So you responsible for what happened after you drink it. You don't get no pass when you drunk. It's true. I may not be completely sober at the moment, but look here, that look in Kendra's eyes sobered me up enough to remember that she's not the only one with problems in this relationship. You 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 wanna spend your life with me, but you wanna tell people you not you don't wanna have kids with me. That, oh, Wait, where did I come from? Oh, oh, oh. oh. That was, for real though? That, that's what I was that's, saying. That's what we on? It's just that, you know, you know, you telling somebody 
to something that you haven't even told me. I'm not saying that I necessarily want to have kids right now, but how you gonna go tell Bambi you don't want to have kids at all? We talking about marriage. Well, we've talked about marriage. We've talked about it, and I feel like we're so feel? close. And then, but then now you don't want to have kids. And then we have an argument about me pouring drinks on women. Hey, this argument. And you not wanting to have kids. It's kind of like even hey, right now. Nothing is even right now. There's no way I'm going to sit here and continue to have a conversation with Jocelyn with him being as drunk as he is because we're not going to get anywhere. Why are you leaving, though? I'm gone because. So you can't even get out. God Whatever. don't want you to leave. So I booked us a tour on the Crony Swamp. Trinidad has everything you want to see in the world. And I wanted my friends to experience everything as much as possible. But we were at Jam Nation till the morning. OK, so who is in control, Carly? Come on, this your country. Yeah, what are we doing? Time to get us on this boat, man. It's time Girl. to go. I'm delirious. Everyone else is still recovering at the hotel. But I managed to get a few of us out the door. After all, we in Trinidad. And I want to get the most out of it. Did you talk to Mo? Dad talked to him all about what? Well, you know you had a curfew. You was out last night. This, oh. until this morning. I mean, no, yeah. No, yeah. No, yeah, yeah. You said yo, soon to be husband that you was out twerking last night? Twerking like a twerking. Do it again. Go on, nigga. Ew, 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 ew. All right, yeah. Yeah. I need to be on your boat. Five be back on his bus. Late. I'm tired. I just got sprinkled on. And it's raining. All right. All right. So sick and tired of people blaming me for bringing Pooh on this trip. She said she was going to apologize. She did not tell me that she was going to bring diapers, sheets, doing pole licking demonstrations. And I certainly didn't know that Jock was going to pour soda down her butt crack. The airline always gonna let us know that they gonna do whatever they got to do to get us our bags back. So we gonna hop in the cab, go on down there and eat dinner with the gang, you feel me? And thanking the Carly, being the one that set up the reservations, <laughs> man, it better be on point. Bartender. Bartender, everybody get a shot of rum. Who's gonna hold Tokyo while I pour this shot down her mouth? <laughs> Since we all at the table together, is there anything that you, Carly, wanted to clear up with Bambi or Kendra? Bambi and Kendra is on this trip, and we're having a good time. We're being cool, we're being cordial, we be, we're, happy, we're turning up. That's all that matters. As long as y'all have to apologize for throwing a shoe at it up. Throw a shoe. You threw a shoe at us, Carly. You ain't gonna tell so I apologize. Oh, OK, OK. <laughs> I accept your apology, Carly. Thank we you. Have... Oh, thank you, brother. You cook this? They, they know what the is that? What a lot said. I book reservations at this particular restaurant so we could all taste some traditional Trinidadian food. But Shikana in Tokyo was just grumbling about the food to the staff, and that was rude as they're the type of chicks that you never want to travel with. They don't like the food. They don't like the hotel. At this point, they should have just stayed home in Atlanta. What's wrong with you? I just feel like, you know, if someone's nice to you, you be nice back. Right. I just want everybody to have a good time. Is somebody not being nice? Who want nice, Carly? Yeah, who want nice, friend? You didn't have to be mean to the I people. I didn't have to be mean. I heard you. You mean to them. You heard. Let me tell you about your chance. You're not gonna bring me to Trinidad and try to 
like, get me jumped on up here with your bull. You know what okay, well, well, I'm saying? Okay, Trinidad is. And you sit up here on this bull. But here's the thing. What's up? You do not want me to tap your ass. No, I'm just stop it now. And you sit up, I'm not standing up for mine. And I'm standing up for mine. Listen, you ain't showing up for mine. 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 Everything a problem for Carly. It's our first night in Trinidad, and she act like everything she want to do, we got to like it. Aren't we allowed to have an opinion of our own? that you used to. I get it. But the thing is, we are here. Give it a chance. Can we just let this go? I thought we were having lots of tails and cocktails. I don't poo poo, but I see what she's saying. See what she's saying about what? About your ass. OK, so you want, we want to talk about poo. Let me let you listen to her husband say it never happened. I really don't appreciate she kind of bringing up poo. But since you want to bring her up at our little table, let me just prove something to you that I proved to Mo. Her husband, Hiram, confirmed that we never did nothing. Who has been telling everybody that I slept with you and I slept with her? I your I did this, I your ass, all type of Yeah, that did it. Thank you. Thank you. It didn't happen. Hey, but can I ask y'all a question? I'm just trying to figure out how I'm here with all these people and my lady. And we talk about somebody whose presence isn't even here right now. Like, I'm saying. I don't even care about none of that. OK, OK, OK. Anyway, um, <clears throat> Bambi, Scrappy, how's life after the baby? It's good. Scrappy, how's life? It's a blessing. Why you got He has a constant attitude now. I don't know if it's because we ain't getting that cracking like we Ooh. used to, but. Y'all going through the not getting the cracking phase? Yes, we are. Why? You know what I'm saying? My <laughs> breasts are leaking for the baby. Like, let's feed her the breast milk. I want the breast milk. I told her I want it. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm, I'm a nasty mom. In my experience, when you start getting into, you know, get a little floor pay popping and a little milk come out, you know, he is drink it up and keep it moving. Not like he trying to get a shot glass and be like, you know what, hold up, baby, before we finish, let me guzzle this titty milk down. Yeah. I love children with all my heart, man. And, and, and you know, he'll find a night that she doesn't want to have kids, man. He definitely feel like I need to step back on the idea of just popping the question. I've been married before, and I want to be a better man for my next wife. was ruined by Miss Doodle, but I'm gonna take a lie detector test so the truth can be known. Other than Pooh, I had the best time introducing my friends to my family, going to Jam Nation to the break of dawn, and the best concert right here ever. My Girl Spice performing at my show Monday is gonna be the best memory I will never forget. Now maybe I ain't getting none on this trip. But you know your boy gonna suck that out when he get home. Hey man, whether we get it cracking or not, being off in Trinidad, seeing Spice do her thing with all my dogs, my friends and stuff, man. Hey man, this is really living, man. This is where you find happy. Hey boy, some face There's tens and thousands of people out here tonight. And even though I'm a little bit nervous, I feel accomplished and I'm so excited to be performing with all friends here in Trinidad tonight because guess what they came just for me and that's already an amazing accomplishment within itself. Make some noise for the queen of dance
reach the big American superstardom as yet, but that don't mean it's not around the corner. It's definitely coming. some damn drama to follow. I had just to step back for a quick second and be like, you know what, I'm gonna deal with this whole Kurt situation when we get home. The bitch need a worry break, okay? So I'm about to chill and kick it tonight and worry about this later. Oh,